Welcome back, everyone. Well, the gauntlet has been thrown down. The challenge laid. Who's up for it? Time to find out. Well, we've been waiting for this one all day long, and here we go. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. Scores! What a shot! Rockford's taking any momentum in this building out here quickly. There'll be a lot of people surprised when they finish buying their popcorn, come to the seats and see that they're trailing 1-0. Colorado's got the puck against the half wall. Unable to reach that one. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Picked up along the wall by Lindstrom. And now it's over to Carroll. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. Moves the no, puck. Still Scores! That's two skill. unanswered now. Uh, they stayed right on it. Once they got that first one, they just pushed the pace of this. Now they get another. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Rockford's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Puck sent over to Savage. Rockford's got it along the wall. Comes up with the stop. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. And that's just out of reach. Rockford's got the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Quick pass to Carroll. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. And he's taken down the official's arm signaling for a penalty. The goaltender is quickly off to his bench to get the extra attacker out. Passes the puck over to Leonard. Here's the official call. Carroll's going off to the box for two minutes. Now you see he hangs his head and heads towards the penalty box. It's always a frustrating penalty to take. Power play unit comes out for the faceoff. And so they'll get their first power play of the evening. At the very least, you want to make sure you get pucks to the net, win some puck battles so you retreat. Six Six the lap lap on the power play! One of the guys skated by as they were starting the power play and leaned over and said, we're getting one here. They're on the board. Is that a called shot? I think it is. Not bad. Rockford's offense has been on fire to start this one and still lots of time left in the first. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Grabbed along the boards by Leonard. Slides it on over to Francis. Offside the call, and we'll have a face off just outside the blue line. Nearing the midway mark of the period, Rockford's got a three goal lead. The Eagles are going to have to find a way to stop the bleeding very quickly. From the right wing, he moves into the middle. Quick feed down low. Out front. That goes off the stick. The Ice Hogs have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Francis has it in their own end. And now he angles it across to Savage. Look out. Uh, Man, he must have been tired of listening to his coach. The coach has been walking a storm behind him, just giving it to his team for the last five minutes. Somebody finally got the message. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. No key in today's game. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Moves it to Leonard. And now he tries to get it across to Wilson. Intercepts the pass at center. That goes off a twig. Rockford's got the puck along the wall. Quick pass to Wilson. Centering pass. Slides the puck down low. Can't maintain possession after that hit. And that's blocked. Hughes works the puck in his own zone. And the referee caught that trip on the play. We've got a delayed penalty coming up. Let's get the call here. Tripping is the call. Did he sell or is that the right one in your no, mind? I think it's the right one. He looks like he's picking up speed and the stick gets into his feet. 
Colorado's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. They've had limited opportunities, but the power play coach now has to get into their ear and give them a little something that will help them crack through. Past the midway mark of the frame, 3 nothing is where we sit. One team really enjoying this night, the other not so much. Taken by Brian. Here's a short pass to Hughes. And the puck departs the zone. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. A chance in front. The Eagles take it along the wing. He almost lost it for a sec. He scores! Well, they've been hoping that the extra work they've done on the power play would help them capitalize. They do a nice job there. The Eagles are still down here, Ray, but not out? Not out, and it's a good thing they found their skates here because this was in danger of being a blowout. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Slides it across to Hughes. Oh, great read on the play. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. Rockford's looking to break out. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. He grabs the puck here at the point. Stays with it. The Ice Hogs take it along the wall. Rockford's gained possession along the boards. Sends it quickly to Carroll. Handles the puck. He scores! What a shot! What a pass! Late goings of this period. Colorado's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. Rockford's got it in their own zone. Slides the puck over. Big time stop there. Away from harm's way. That's a good save. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Puck scooped up off the crossbar. Colorado's close, but they can't get close enough. That shot hits the goalpost and stays out. The Eagles ready to go on the attack. Scores! All over the rebound, and he puts it in. That's a terrific comeback for them. They've been playing from behind the entire game. They finally tie it up. Puck possession so critical. Another faceoff coming up here. Rockford's got the puck now. Moved out in front. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. Hughes wins it in the dots. Receives the pass. Great glove save. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Al's taking it from his own end. Feeds it on over to Savage. Oh, man, he got hit again. Man, he must feel like a pinata out there. He's been on his backside a half a dozen or more times tonight. And that'll do it for period number one. No shortage of offense. Woo. I'm exhausted after that. Still to come, we'll be right back with much more action here on EA Sports.
Period number two seems ready to go. The teams are set. My broadcast partner, Ray Ferrar, was also set. Let's do this. High scoring affair, setting the tone to the first 20. Let's see if it can keep up here in period number two. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Colorado's probably in a spot that they deserve to be in. They haven't had the puck very much. Of course, they're going to be chasing the game. From the neutral zone now. Francis takes the puck. Grabs it in his own end. And now he moves it to Savage. Hughes has it in the defensive end. Slides it over with pace to Lindstrom. Now a quick pass to Carroll. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Couldn't connect on that pass. Handles the puck at the point. And he's going after him here. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Brian's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. Centered out in front. Here's an offensive chance. Hammered into the boards. Wow, he closed off his room, slammed him into the boards. They're still rattling. The cannon from the point. And that goes off a player. Quick feed to Savage. And that puck leaves the zone. Play blown dead. Penalty coming up here. And tripping looks to be the call, Ray. Really a frustrating penalty to take because you're just fishing for the puck. You get your stick in the wrong spot. The guy goes down and you're toast every time. Colorado's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They've been working hard looking for the equalizer. What a chance here on the power play. Off his stick. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? On their heels, trying to clear. And a nice job by the Killers on that one. Yeah, now they can get a change, get some fresh players on the ice. Tries to get it over to B-Bunny. Takes the pass. The Eagles will play it against the boards. Referee Shilovec's hand is in the air. We've got a penalty coming up. Play comes to a stop, and let's see what the call is. The Eagles are off to the box. Interference the call. He's got to keep his feet moving so he doesn't get called for interference. Puck grabbed by Lindstrom. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Moves it over to B-Bunny. Colorado's got the puck against the boards. Quick shot. There he is on the redirect. Scores! They've been clawing away at this lead, James, trying to get this game back even. And there's the goal that does it. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck picked up by Lindstrom. Ten seconds. With possession along the wall. Moves it quickly over to Lindstrom. Turn that one aside. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. From the left side, they enter the offensive zone. Moves it to Wilson. Gets down in front for the block. Whiffs on that. That pass goes a little sideways. Excellent stick work on the play. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Considered a win for the penalty killers as the power play fails to execute. Always frustrating for the power play when they go back to the bench and don't have anything to show for it. B-Bunny's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Lindstrom. Colorado's this is training camp for you, buddy. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Here they are on the attack. Sends it over. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Jabs the puck away. That opportunity's rejected. Brian's got it in the defensive end. Colorado's moving the puck through center ice. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's all tied up. Francis wins it. And now it's grabbed by Leonard. Backtracks with the puck but maintains possession. Quick pass to Francis. Rocks him on the play. Takes the feed. 
Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Fails to find the open man. Cats on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Getting into the later stages of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Nice pass. And he slides it quickly to Francis. Good defensive stop with the poke check. The Eagles will play it in their own end. Passes it to Lindstrom. The Ice Hogs pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Now over to Lindstrom. Here's a short pass to Bryan. Rockford's in now. Quick feed to Savage. Misses high. Not a bad shot. He just tried to make it too perfect. And that's the hat trick. Well, it's on the road, so nobody's got to clean up the chapeaus. There's none on the ice. A disgruntled crowd watches the opposing player celebrate his hat trick. Has taken the wind out of the sails from this crowd. Second period nearly in the book. Whoa! Here. Centered out in front! Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Lindstrom's moving the puck through his own zone. Couldn't complete the play. Can't get a hold of that pass. Period number two is in the books. There's been no shortage of offense tonight. just around the corner. Drop the puck here in period number three. It's been quite the night of fireworks thus far. Let's see what this third period can do to keep up. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who was at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? Rockford's got a lead in this game, which is probably a last shot win sort of thing. Man, it's been out of control for two periods. I love it. Here's a shot and a great scene. Krause opts to hang on to it to get a whistle. You start to wear down a little bit. You need your goalie to help you out. We're still in the early stages of this period. We've got a 5-4 game. Rock first won the draw and they'll go to work. And he says no. Grabs control of it at the point. Savage has got the puck. There's the physical side. The Eagles slide it through center. From point blank, denies him in front. Cat's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Rockford's won the draw. Gets it over to Al. Dishes it to Leonard. Slides the puck across to Savage. They've got the defense. Sit right down. Hard hit of the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Rockford's got the puck in the defensive end. And now he moves it quickly Sit to down. Savage. And that pass goes awry. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Stretches one out to Hughes. Nice defensive robbery on that. Sends it across. Can't find his man. Feeds the puck to Carroll. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. 
inching closer to the midway mark of the period. Nine goals and counting so far. It's 5-4. Francis wins the draw. Scooped up along the wall by Leonard. And he slides it quickly to Francis. Rockford's got the puck along the wall. He's got a step. He's calling a penalty shot. Tripped up on the play while he's in the clear. The penalty shot is the right call. Carroll's ready for the penalty shot. Denies him. Well done. Good stop. Colorado's got it, and they're on the attack. And he stands tall in goal. And it's a quick pass to Wilson. Skates no, to the crease. He scores! It's good to be greedy. You get one, you chase that next one. Really put your foot down on the opponent. So nice, they snipe twice. The setters will glide into the dot. Colorado's won the draw in the neutral zone. Passes on over to Lindstrom. The Eagles played along the wing. And he regains control of the puck. Rockford's looking to break out of their own end. Here's a chance. To his teammate. Denies him. Now a quick pass to Carroll. And sends it just out of reach. Taken along the wall by Leonard. And now he passes up to Savage. They've got numbers. And on the heels of that big hit, he's being called out. Savage is not so sure about the weight class here. He says no thanks. Picked up along the boards by Brian. Dished on over to Carroll. Cuts into the paint. Now he slides it up to Lindstrom. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Knocked away. And he slides it quickly to Francis. Pass stolen in the open ice. Dumps it in. Cat's got the puck. Boy, he's been under fire tonight. Been really sharp and in a close game. You can't make a mistake that costs a critical goal. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Locks him up on the draw as they take possession. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. Here's an odd man rush. Slides it across. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Pushes it across to Savage. Wrist shot from the slot. And that goalie is getting just torched down there. Three in a row here. Rockford's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forechecked. Well, there's really nothing they haven't done tonight. Sends it over to Savage. Here's Sit a blast down. blocked in traffic. Picks up a head of steam, and the officials wave off the icing. He wasn't going to give up on that puck. He beats the defenseman to it. Picked up along the wall by Leonard. Hangs onto the puck. Moves it quickly over to Al. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Wrist went in front, and he gets down to block it. Carroll's got it in the defensive zone. Inside of the final minute here in the third. Couldn't catch up to that pass. There's the whistle icing the call. The centerman glide into position. Look at this, he's calling him out here, Ray. Yeah, he wants to go. He's not very happy. The Eagles win the faceoff. They've got a tired group against them. That win sets up an offensive play. Sends it out right in front, and he totally whiffs on it. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Savage's eyes are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. And he slides it quickly to Lindstrom. 
can't connect. The Ice Hogs have it against the wall. Pokes the puck away. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Some pushing and shoving here heating up. Yeah, the few words lead to a little bit more, it looks like. From the point, they take control of it. Wide of the net. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if he can't get the puck at the goaltender. Offside is the call, but we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. And a challenge being thrown down here. Yeah, it came out of nowhere a little bit, and the challenge is down. And we are all over with this one. Well, Razor, you want to sum this one up for us? Yeah, bad choice, bad decisions. We've all made them. Those guys just made one. I believe the term is stay in your lane.
You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel.
You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You call that a shot? You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. You keep finding your way onto my highlight reel. Call that a 
shot? You breaking in some new pads there, goalie?
Welcome back, everyone. Ray Ferraro and James Stavolsky ready to bring you all the action as we are about to find out who's ready to answer this challenge. Truth is almost upon us here. They are about to drop the puck. The Stars start with possession as we are now underway. Jostling for the puck and it's knocked away. Here comes the pushback. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. B. Bunny's looking around for somebody to fight. He's going to have to go and fill the dance card somewhere else. Boarding the call on the play. Judgment call always for the official. Is it okay to make the play? Or is he a little overzealous, which is what he was called there? Grabbed along the board by Thornton. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. There's another stop. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The game is still scoreless. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Lindstrom stick handling in his own zone. The Stars take possession in the defensive end. Trying to clear the puck from his own end. And they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Time winding down here. One last chance with this man advantage. They've spent too much time going up and down the ice. They're going to get it into the zone quickly. Moves it to Thornton. Kicked up ahead to his teammate who skates away. Both teams back to even strength as the power play expires, and we are still tied here. Oh, when the puck moves and the feet don't, this is what you get. You have lots of zone time, but no real dangerous chances on that power play. And a nasty whack after the whistle here. Yeah, he went after him pretty good there. That's a hard slash. The Stars win the draw. Colorado's got the puck in their own end. The Stars have it in the offensive zone. And that one's stopped. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We're still scoreless. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Possession earned on the draw, James. We'll see if they can set something up. And now it's over to Carroll. Picked off in the open ice. What a steal in his own end. The Eagles will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Moves the puck along the half wall. Sends the pass down low. Right up front. 
stopped by the goaltender. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Icing his call, stopping the play dead. Center's jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. And that's broken up. And gets it in deep in the opposite corner. Maintains possession. Sends a pass over. Quick pass to Hughes. Smart heads up play to neutralize the threat. Here they are on the attack. The Eagles have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Unable to reach that one. Tees him up. Oh, what a stop. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. Still scoreless in this one. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Fires it. Misses over the net. Sends it down low. Texas plays it against the boards. Slides the puck down low. Shot right in front. Scores. Oh, that was a beauty. The Stars finally open the scoring here in this one. Been a pretty tight period so far. The initial goal might creak the door open a little bit for more offense. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Right in front of the official's eyes. And the hand is in the air. And now he moves it quickly to Baji Holahi. Handles it along the blue line. Here's a short pass to Ehlers. Texas will play Stay the puck down. from the corner. Right out front. And they can't convert on the play. Quick feed to Anthony. And it's a quick pass to Ehlers. And play finally comes to an end. Here's the officials. The Eagles don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. Played with fire. He got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck, and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down, and he's got to go to the box. Takes it at center. A chance from the slot. Stones him in front. Dead center. Excellent save. And that one's broken up. Dabrink, it's lugging the puck. Drives to the paint. Made that stop. But he came out and challenged a good save. Here in the late goings of the period, Texas leads it 1-0. Hughes quick on the draw. Puck slid down the ice. Texas takes possession along the wall. And now he angles oh, it across to Thornton. I didn't see that coming. Sorry, James. Jumped in on you there, but that hit was huge as the play was just moving along. Moves the puck over to Thornton. Here's the pass. That's a textbook save by Fumagalli. Lidstrom's now out of the box, and we are back to even strength. Pretty hard to have a more low-intensity power play than that. It really didn't generate a thing, and when you don't generate much, you're sure not going to score. Hughes wins possession in the defensive zone. Sends the pass over. It's a two-on-one. They scores! They tie it up! They stayed with it the entire time, Ray! I'm tired of listening to coaches talk about, oh, we followed the process, but the process is you don't get frustrated, you keep chipping away, and you hope to get to this point. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Thornton's won the draw here in the open ice. No one home on that play. And now he tries to get it across to Ehlers. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. And now he moves it to Carroll. Couldn't complete the play. The Stars move the puck in the defensive zone. Thornton's been tripped up and we got a penalty coming up here. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. The Eagles are going to be shorthanded, tripping the call. It's funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. You're kind of stuck. Off the draw and he ties up his opponent. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Johns gets on top of the puck, stopping the play. 
Now you can get some fresh guys on the ice, get yourself restarted. Just here in the late stages of this frame, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. From the point, looks to make something happen. Keeps hold of the puck, and that's blocked away. Carroll's going to play it to the corner. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. Rister, spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? And there's the horn concluding period number one as both teams get on the board. head to the respective rooms. Two more periods still to come. We're looking forward to it here on EA Sports. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. The Stars win possession here as we open up the period, and that power play is still intact. Manages to hang on. Pass right on the doorstep. Puts it into the back of the net for the goal. That breaks this tie, James. You know when these teams get locked up tight, sometimes it stays that way a long time. The Stars go ahead by one. They had to work for that one. A lot of work put in just to get yourself inching into the lead. There's still lots of time left. And that goes off the face of the goaltender. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. The Stars have taken the lead here over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on it. Ref's arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. Quick whistle stops the play. The Stars will serve two minutes in the box. Sometimes you get caught in the wrong spot on the ice. He clearly interferes with the other player's progress. Wrong place, wrong time. You're right on that one, Ray. Takes a slap shot from the point. Gets down low and blocks it. Colorado's got it near the point. Lidstrom's got it along the wing. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kraus. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. A chance to get it out of the defensive zone. That one's blocked. No luck. It stays in. Now he's got to do a little bit better than that, James. That puck's got to go out. That's a tough turnaround for them. Now a quick pass to B. Bunny. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. They clear the zone. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Texas has found a way to get a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead in the second. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. And they remain a goal behind as the power play comes up short. You work so hard to get yourself back in the game, you earn a power play, and then you fail to cash in. So they still trail by one. The game will continue at even strength. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Takes the feed. Moves the puck. He can't connect. He scores. They tied it up. Brand new game. All that work that's gone behind this, and we're back to even Steven. He's tight to the net. He doesn't have much time, and that snapshot beats the goaltender from the low slot. The Eagles have even the score here in this second period. We thought this was going to be a really good hockey game. Now it's tied up here. 
as we get ourselves into the middle part of the frame. Scooped up along the wall by Debrinkit. And he slides it quickly to Anthony. Colorado's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Nothing doing on that. Way to throw it. Shot gives them nothing in front. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Pop moved over to Carroll. Moves it to Hughes. Nice poke check. Texas gains a hold of it. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Denied by the goaltender. Slides it over to Hughes. Couldn't make that one happen. A shot! That goes off the mask! More than half the period left to play. It's all tied up. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. That eyes him on the play. The Eagles have it now. Texas gains control of the puck. Takes a shot, and that's broken up. Works it across to Carroll. Intercepts it at center. Ehlers frightens the other team as soon as he collects the puck here. He's got two. He's looking for a hat trick. Trying to gain a step. They've got the defense outnumbered. Oh, oh boy, I think I pulled something. Goaltender comes up big in good position to make the save. Taken along the wall by Debrinkit. Ehlers plays it along the wall. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Past the midway mark of the frame. We are all tied up in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. Texas on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Thornton. Carroll's got the puck now in his own end. Nice dish from the left wing. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Official blows the whistle. Let's see what the call is. The Stars are being called for tripping. Pretty easy call for the referee to make as you're fishing around for the puck. He's focused in on the play, and when the player goes down, his hand will go up. And that carries off a stick, and we'll get a face-off as the puck goes out of play. The setters will glide into the dot. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. And a successful clearing attempt. Picked up along the boards by Thornton. Can't catch up to the pass. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Hughes. There's a nasty slash that'll get some attention. Yeah, it should. It looked like he's chopping wood. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And that shot dies in traffic. Texas steps inside. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Sacrifices the body to block it. And a great job by the shorthanded unit those last few moments as the penalty expires. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but... Just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through their fingers. Makes a move in front. With the stop. Taken by Thornton. Delayed penalty looming. And play comes to an end as someone is heading to the sin bin. The Eagles have been handed two for interference. You can slow a player down, but it can't be that obvious. He gets involved in his lane of skating, and interference will be the call. And he slides it quickly to Vaggie Holahi. Turn that chance aside. Here in the late goings of the period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Eagles take possession off the faceoff. Texas has possession of the puck in the offensive end. Stopped by the goaltender. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. The centermen glide into position. Thornton's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. From off the boards, he sends it into the open ice. A chance on goal! Routine glove stop by Fumagalli. Oh, getting a little cheeky there.
Texas will go to work here in the offensive end. Carroll's got the puck along the wing. Here's a chance to clear the defensive zone. And he's able to move the puck across the blue line and out of harm's way. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Time's up on the power play. Both teams back to even strength. Well, it doesn't take long to add up their power play goals tonight. Lots of chances. Nothing on the board. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Here's a short pass to Hughes. Sends it over. And that one's broken up. Great block there. And come on! It's been a tightly contested affair this far as the period comes to an end. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. It's been a fun one so far, all tied up as we are now underway here in the third period. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Colorado's looking to break out of their own end. Carroll swooping in on the attack. Shuts him down. Make the save, help yourself out at the same time. Good stop, but the better part is that he gets the puck away from the front of the net. Quick feed to Thornton. Sends it across. And that one's broken up. By and look at this. It's a parent all alone. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break, and it's in the net. Coach is a pretty active on the bench there, Ray. What are you hearing? Well, they're happy that they've got the lead, but they want to make sure that nobody sits back to defend. Tries to get the puck to Thornton. Play rolls on. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Sends it to the cross side. Moves with the puck at the corner. Hughes takes it inside his own end. That pass doesn't go. Moves it to Thornton. That's broken up in the neutral zone. The Eagles have been in such good position all night long. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Moves it quickly over to Vaji Holahi. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Right in front of the net. And the parade to the penalty box will continue as play is called for yet another penalty. The Eagles will lose a man tripping the call. I guess it's a little bit of bad luck, James. I mean, he's reaching for the puck. He's in position to try and keep the play moving, but he trips him up. Ehlers has got it along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. Sharp reaction save. They're still shoving long after the whistle's gone here. Somebody wants to go. Thornton's not interested in dropping the mitts and going at it. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Colorado's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. Ehler swings it behind the net. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. They get it out of the defensive end. Vajrahulahi's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, he almost put him through the boards. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. And it comes 
Comes up with the save. Handles the pass from his goalie. Quick pass to Thornton. The Eagles will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Here he is. All alone. Oh, boy. I think oh, I pulled something. How did he keep that one out? What a save. Texas has been the better team. They've had more scoring opportunities, and yet they trail in the third. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Texas is in the offensive zone. From point blank, he scores! There's the hat trick, and here come the hats. Man, it is loud in here. The guys jumped up on the bench as soon as that third goal went into the net. Texas will go to work as they win the draw. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. Coughs it up at center. On the attack along the boards. Texas looks to move the puck from their own end. Moves into the slot. Dismissed that chance. fumagalli has got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We got a tie game. It's in the back of the net. He scores! A couple goals in right around a minute and 50 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Tosses it to Lidstrom. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Texas players were saying earlier this morning that they wanted to create more offense. They have done just that, and they lead here in the third. Buck has dropped, and we are back underway. Here's a chance. Sit down. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Slides it across to Carroll. Anthony scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Sit down. Lowers the boom with that hit. Stop that one. Picked up along the wall by Thornton. Big save. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Carroll's got the puck in his own zone. Grabbed along the wall by Lindstrom. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Dishes it to Hughes. Steps into all of that. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Levels him with the hit. Tries to feed it over to Anthony. Tries to the crease. The Eagles have it from their own end. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Here's a short pass to Ehlers, and they fail to go tape to tape. Texas will try to make something happen here in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Ehlers. Puts it on net, denies him, he got all of it. Fumagalli's gonna hang on and just... Settle down for a moment. You really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. The Stars lead it late in this third period. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Texas looks to break out in their own end. Slides the puck ahead to Anthony. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. In the final moments of this period, it's been a fun one here tonight. 4-3 hockey game. Texas is quick on the draw. Stays with it. A little banging and crashing now. Scores! They are on fire! Yeah, and it's all different sources, too. Score a goal, make a change, get another one. Nothing seems to slow them down. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Nearing the final minute of the third. 
takes it into the slot. Off the mask of the goaltender, boy, right between the eyes. There's a whistle as the official's calling for a penalty here. Thornton's getting called for tripping. They're going to be down a man here. Once he gets his stick into the player's feet, it's almost inevitable a tripping penalty will result. Tough to argue that call. We'll get a face-off as the puck skips out onto the bench. Anthony's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Texas moves ahead with the puck and manages to clear the zone. Scooped up along the wall by Ehlers. Stones up with the blocker. And that's just out of reach. And he passes it up ahead to Ehlers. Here's a chance behind the net. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. Gilles Levesque blows the whistle, and someone is off to the box. And he's going off interference the call, Ray. Looks like a pretty easy call to make as he completely cuts off the lane for the player to skate through. The Stars send their man advantage unit out once more. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. And here's the pass to Carroll. They've got numbers. To his teammate. Turns it away. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. He scores! What a run of play this has been. Four straight goals for them. They have not taken their foot off the gas at all. You don't get many of these odd man rushes, so you better take advantage of them. They move the puck quickly and aggressively, and the goalie couldn't keep up to the shot. Texas came ready to play tonight. Tons of scoring chances, and they lead it big time here late in this third. Slides the puck across to Lindstrom. Oh, comes up with a stop. And that's all she wrote.